This is the newest FOMO. I'm serious. Take a look at this headline. Money market funds are the rage currently. In the first two months of the year, close to 100 million has flowed into Singapore managed money market funds. So what exactly is money market funds and what is all the big hype about? Now, money market funds are next to no risk because you cannot say that they are risk-free. They are just bonds that are so short that mature in weeks only. So typically, there's no default risk. And usually when you buy high quality government related bonds, there's almost little chances of you losing your principal. So that's why with interest rates going up, money market funds are right now offering 3 plus percent even. And that's why people are getting excited about it. So if you're keen to find out what are the best offers in the market, continue watching on. Hi guys, welcome back. I think I sound a bit weird and towards the end of this video, I'll explain why. But I promise you a tour around all the best offers in the market. And let's start with our robo advisors. Scythe Cash Plus, they're offering 3.5% per annum ready with their portfolio using Lion Global, Money Market Fund and Lion Global Enhanced Liquidity Fund. Stash Away, they have two portfolios and Stash Away Simple Plus is offering 4.6 to 5% with underlying funds, Lion Global Enhanced Liquidity Fund, Nico AM Shanta Short Term Bond Fund and Lion Global Short Duration Bond Fund. What about for Endow Us? You would see that they have three cash managed portfolios and Ultra in particular has a projected yield of 4.6 to 4.9%. Not as good as Stash Away but better than Scythe Cash Plus, right? This is the conclusion? Maybe not, because that's not the best way or not the right way to look at things. Because using what Endowas has actually shared generously, they've made this disclosure of historical max loss. I'm using this to illustrate the risk, because when we choose the ultra portfolio, you would see that the historical max loss is 5.07%. And this actually occurred very recently because interest rates spiked up. Now many people don't understand, when interest rates go up, bond prices go down. But money market funds mature in a few weeks that such that interest rate go up also doesn't matter because you hold to maturity, there's no losses. But bonds, when they are longer maturity, typically the price needs to drop to reflect the change in interest rate situations. So money market funds are the only ones that are really not interest rate sensitive still. And learning from how Endowas has actually displayed their products, we can actually see that when we have more money market solutions, which is the first one over there on top left, Fullerton SGD Cash Fund, 50% of it is inside the secure portfolio, you would realize that the projected return is less, but the max drawdown is negligible. On the other hand, the ultra, which is the highest yielding one, there is next to no money market solution and everything is short duration bond funds. So what about our local brokerage platforms, correct? Let's look over here. Tiger Vault, they allow you to purchase money market funds, Fullerton SGD cash fund at 3.9%, whereas Moomoo allows you to buy the same fund at 3.7%. Actually, I drew this image together to show you that the fund is exactly the same. This difference in interest projected you is just simply a timing issue. They are still ultimately the same funds. So don't go and suspect that one is better than the other simply because of the presented figure over there. So if you understand already, let me next show you a summary table of all the various robot advisors and platforms in a screenshot that you can take down. And before you get there, smash the like button, smash the subscribe, especially if you have benefited from content like this. And here it goes. In this summary table, I've summarized Endow Us, Stash Away, Scythe, Money Hour, and three of our most popular discount brokerages. I've highlighted them in red. There's a key difference. When the robo portfolios offer you a solution, they do it as a package solution whereby they inserted multiple bond funds or money market funds within it. Whereas brokerage platforms ask you to choose for yourself which one, and they just present an estimated projected yield. But what we can see quite consistently is that previously, Lion Global SGD Enhanced Liquidity Fund was very in the limelight for the last two years. Every robo portfolio had it inserted into its composition. But right now, discount brokerages are pushing the Fullerton SGD Cash Fund. I think this chart can explain why Lion Global Enhanced Liquidity Fund has underperformed Fullerton SGD Cash Fund quite significantly in the last two years. We would see that the red line was outperforming correct until about a year ago, whereby the blue line went exponential, whereas the red line just climbed that much slower. I can only show you the chart. I can't quite explain why the difference in performance, because to me, they are very similar. 
And I'm also puzzled as to why one is outperforming and if it's outperforming, hopefully we pick it and it continues to do so. What I can show you next is a comparison of all the various popular money market funds and short duration bond funds. They are Philip Money Market Fund, Fullerton SGD Cash Fund which I've covered just now, Lion Global Enhanced Liquidity Fund which I've just covered just now, Nico AM Short Term Bond Fund, Lion Global SGD Money Market Fund and United SGD Fund Class A. You would see that there are two lines, correct? which is the green and the purple one which has been in negative territory. This is the short duration bond fund, namely Nico AM Shenton short term bond fund and United SGD fund. These two funds I put into picture because these are the only two funds that are supposedly very low risk and are used for CPF shielding frequently. I do that also for my private clients. But you will realize that they are also negatively impacted when interest rates spiked up tremendously over the last one year. Hopefully things will normalize and they have right now recovered some of their losses and how bond funds work is every time a bond matures, they would buy a new bond in. So they actually have no maturity date. When interest rates go up, yes, there's mark to market losses, but over time, that should also even out. But the story again is Fullerton SGD Cash Fund, which is that red line over there that is the number one over the last two years. Why it has done well or why is it promoted also? My guess is because its annual expense ratio is possibly the lowest among its peers. If we compare money market funds, Philip Money Market Fund and United SGD, you would realize that Fulton's SGD cash fund has the lowest expense ratio. And since they are similar in nature, I guess paying less expense ratio would definitely help in performance. And right now they have indeed the biggest fund size, clocking at $2.3 billion. So if you'd like to purchase for yourself Fulton SGD cash fund, let me suggest two platforms that I actually use myself. The first is actually Moomoo. Right now they have a promotion whereby you can actually get $2 cashback every day for 10 days if you contribute at least $100 into your account. If you like to invest and trade in stocks, there are further coupons that you can clock as you can see over here. And if you are new to the platform, use my referral links below. The second one to suggest for you is actually Tiger Brokers. Tiger Brokers right now has a promotion, 3 day 20% yield coupon as a welcome gift. To earn for yourself Apple shares worth 30 US dollars Simply make an initial deposit of $1,000 and complete 5 buy trades. If you like to do bigger top-ups, you can even get a flash offer whereby you can get one full Apple share. As always, terms and conditions apply and this promotion is for a limited period. So if you're keen also, look for my links below. I have a special partnership with them. And thank you again for using my referral links. Coming to here, I've actually done a survey on my Telegram group. I've discovered that actually Moomoo's Cash Plus and Tiger Vote are among the more popular brokerages. But most have actually chosen to do high interest accounts like UOB1 or simply buy t bills or SSB. So I should address the difference also. When you put money in high interest account, it's guaranteed by the bank. So that's fantastic. And more often than not, I think that already works. But usually for like UOB1 account, you realize that there are certain hurdles to cross, correct? You need card spending. You need to have the full 100,000 to max out that highest tier. And if you have more than 100,000, you don't get anything significant above that already. On the other hand, Singapore Savings Bonds and T-Bills, you would realize that there are dates that you need to complete transactions. It's not so easy to buy, sell, or not so liquid in some ways. Because funds, whether it's money market or short duration bond, usually they can liquidate and give you back your cash in just a couple of working days. So hopefully that answers some of your questions. And as I mentioned at the start, my voice is now hoarse because I've been battling COVID and this is day three. So I've been really struggling to put something out, but I believe that you know we should always make conscious effort to take small steps, must up some energy, keep a step forward, that's how we become excellent, be consistent. That's how I motivate myself to stick to my motto. And also here in this wave, many are infected for the first time like myself. So if you also, I wish you all the best, get well soon, get well soon for me also, and I'll see you next video. Take care as always, goodbye.